Hi guys, John, Common Sense Outdoors. What I want to talk to you about right now is the signal mirror. Let me throw it around first. <clears throat> if you've ever heard somebody say, or you think you have to have an expensive rectangle signal mirror with a sight glass that you can look through, you don't. Any mirror will work. This you have to know a female daughter mother girlfriend sister wife somebody you know is female and is throwing these away this comes out of their makeup container it's got the little powder stuff on one side and the mirror on the other side folds up they'll throw those away when they're done with them that's a free signal mirror all day a little bit tricky to get out if you don't know how to do it so let me tell you how to do it before you go grab a, your your wife's mirror out of the bathroom drawer and try to steal it from her <clears throat> if you try to pry it out it will break get a hair dryer hold the hair dryer to the back of the makeup case on the opposite side of the mirror so the mirror's here, it's inside this little lid. Hold the hair dryer here for a while and heat that up. There's some glue in here that holds that mirror in. Once it's heated up, take a razor blade and try to slide it in real slow and easy about halfway. Once you get it slid in about halfway, just take your razor blade, swing it around in a circle and it'll come right out without breaking. So, first thing, that was the first thing. You don't have to spend a bunch of money on a signal mirror. You can get one for free. And this is going to work just as well as something with a, a little hole I can look through. I don't need to look through it for it to work. The next thing I want to talk about is there's some very smart people out there but even sometimes a smart person is wrong. Some people believe that if the sun is there, like it is at the moment, I can only refer, reflect that light back 180 degrees, somewhere in that direction. That's just simply not true. If I get the mirror in the sun, And I can reflect that light onto my hand. Okay, that's straight up. Now if I can pull my hand down like this and still have that reflection follow it, I'm now casting that signal completely the other direction. The sun is at the west. I am completely signaling to the east right there. Hope you can see that in the viewfinder. The next thing is, do I need the little hole that I can look through to be able to find that helicopter, look through that? No, not at all. If I hold this consistent and I find the sun with it and I hold my fingers up, where I'm looking through my fingers, is right where that's going. Hope that wasn't too bright on you. As long as I hold this consistent and find the sun onto my hand, wherever that goes, I'm signaling to. I just signaled the opposite direction of the sun again. It's not impossible and you don't need some expensive signal mirror to get it done. So, go steal your daughter's or your girlfriend's or your wife's mirror, or ask her first. Chances are she's probably got a whole bunch of them that are almost empty. From the women that I know, they don't throw them away right away. There's a good chance a female that you know has one of these in a drawer somewhere. Go get yourself a free signal mirror and practice with it. And 
like I just showed you, you can signal 360 degrees from the sun if you get your angles right. But it takes a little bit of practice. So get your free mirror, get out there and practice, be able to signal away. Is that the best signaling option in the world? No, but we're going to talk about that in another video. So thanks for watching, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. More videos coming to you soon.